talking. I'm good with that. Let's jump into some college football here. Jim Harbaugh wrote an open letter to college football and the NFL. And in that letter, uh, rather than just read the whole thing out, let me just give you the basis here. He is asking the NFL to allow players to go into the league. Tia said, I'm a guy. There you go. All right. I don't have to worry about that anymore. Uh, Harbaugh is asking the NFL to allow players to be draft eligible at any age. If they are ready for the NFL, they should be allowed to go. I think we agree. In that same vein, he is also asking the NCAA to allow players that go undrafted to be able to come back to school if they go undrafted. I got I got no beef with either of those. I got things. no beef I've, with either. I've been the, the the undrafted part. I've been screaming for years, and and I did, I did, basketball the exact same thing. I think it's. I think this is a necessary step. This yeah. is a necessary addition. Tyrone said, "I'm giving you crap. I'm just kidding." Hey, we know you're just playing. That's okay. It's a lot of fun. I can take it well. <laughs> Don't get my feelings all the time. No, you Sometimes. got that right. Sometimes today isn't one of those days. No, no, no. It's a, today. Today you you in a good mood, man. You got a couple of jobs done. You got my well, floors I, done. I don't have any work tomorrow except for meeting a couple of customers, and that's it. And then collecting some paychecks. And those are always nice. Only work I got to do tomorrow is handling Mother's Day for my mother. And um, yeah, that's about it. Really. Not ready for that. And and watching the UFC. And that is that's all I'm into. I got to figure out Mother's Day. When all we get I'm into. Sleep. So, back to this Harbaugh stuff. Uh, it, some of this stuff just seems like common sense, right? Um, <laughs> ben said Harbaugh is crying for Shea back. Uh, Shea couldn't come back anyway. Shea was a senior. Shea was a senior. And Harbaugh yeah. don't care about Shea. He I, halfway cared about him. Yeah. There I was don't think talks this, that yeah. Shea didn't, wasn't going to win that job last year. So. Nope. nope. I mean, it's true. I mean, he, he got pulled a, at one point in, early in the In a couple season. of games, yeah. Yeah, I mean, so, he just, at some point in time, yeah. It no, is it th- is. this is this, – I don't – so the NFL can do whatever they want. If they allowed one and duns or two and duns or whatever, then it wouldn't change a whole lot about college football because there are very few kids that have the physical attributes the way Maurice Claret had to where after their freshman year they could go. Okay? Yeah. Very few. Trevor Lawrence could have gone after his freshman year. That, that, nobody argue that. We would now be back in the days of there's no way he would have started as an NFL player that early, but he would have pulled an Aaron Rodgers, sit down for two, three years. Now, would leagues want to do that knowing they're losing that rookie year to build around a star with him on the bench? I don't know the answer to that, but very few players have the ability to come out early. This is not basketball. But I do think those who do – should yeah, Clowney's Marshawn Marshawn Latimer, year. yeah. Well, it, it, so South Carolina year, absolutely he should have been able to come out. South Nobody Carolina had multiple. Marshawn Lattimore, the running back at South Carolina, oh, back yes. on the Spurrier. Yeah. It oh, had he. I mean, think about the money that he could have made after his freshman year when yeah. Spurrier ran him forty some odd times for two hundred eighteen yards and four touchdowns in the swamp in a win against Florida. He should have been able to come out that year. That his sophomore season. Jacks up his knee. Junior year, jacks up the other knee. Goes ahead and comes out and gets drafted in, what, sixth, seventh round, something like yeah, that. Yeah, very, very, very late by the 49ers, yes. right? Yes. At that point, he would have been drafted. He probably would have been a first-round pick after his freshman year. Maurice Claret probably would have been no first or second round no after doubt. his first season. Like, yeah. those guys were built and were ready for the NFL yeah, immediately. Yeah, they were ready. Yeah. It, it, the, but hang on. There's a reason we know these names. It's because it's not enough of them to really change the game too much. Yeah. But it's still fair for them to have their shot and their opportunity. And it doesn't really hurt the league. It's the league's choice. And here's the nice thing. If you want to declare for the draft after your freshman year and you don't get drafted, come back to school and then declare after your sophomore year. You don't get drafted, come back to school and declare after you. Like, this is not a hard problem to solve. Uh, Matt just said, don't they do that with college baseball and hockey? Not in baseball. Baseball and hockey have it right. Yes. That's in it. baseball and hockey, you can get drafted. Out and of high school. Say, I don't want the team. I don't want to go to that team. I'm coming back to school. Yeah. And not play for that team. Yeah, there we go. Ben, ben jumped in and said, hockey players and baseball players get drafted and sign with the team whenever they want. 
So yeah. basically, I mean, you're drafting the right. Uh, Kyler Murray did that. Kyler Murray got drafted by the A's in baseball and then said, mm, I think I want to play quarterback. And so he came back to school. Yeah. I mean, it's it, and it's he had a signing bonus, like a massive signing bonus while he was still a football player at Oklahoma. I, I'm just the NCAA. Forget about the 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 NFL rule. The NFL, I don't think, will budge. They don't like people telling them what to do. Okay. I don't think it hurts them because I don't think many. Here's the thing: I think the NFL would be more open to it as long as the NCAA had the stipulation that if we don't take these kids, you got to take them back because it's not that we don't want them; we just don't want them right now. Yeah, no, that's that's totally fair. Because college basketball is the exact same way. By the way, D- Dan Wetzel came up with this number the other day. He did the research on it a couple of weeks back. And every year, consistently, there's an average of 40 kids that are juniors or sophomores or more or freshmen that declare for the NBA draft and don't get drafted, but they're not allowed to come back to school. So that's 40 kids across the country that should be coming back to college yeah. and are not. Now, the baseball rule is a pretty interesting rule. The baseball rule is you can come out of high school. Or you can go to college for one year, enter the draft after one year, get drafted. If you come back after your uh, freshman year, you have to stay until your junior year is over. So you can't enter the draft every year. You can enter it after a freshman, and then you must stay two more years before you try and enter it again. Yeah. Um, I'm okay with that rule. I'm okay with anything that gives them – some opportunity to test these waters. If you don't get drafted, there is no reason that Thaddeus Moss is not coming back to LSU. He yes. didn't get drafted. Then let him come back. Yeah, I, I'm with you. I'm with you. Uh, McKinnon said Harbaugh's plan is a great plan so long as it's legitimately adhered to in regards to agents contacting players. Here is the other side of that. Here's my thought process on it. And I think Chris agrees. Why does it matter? That you should be able to contact agents and whatnot. You should have somebody that's walking you through the process and helping you prepare for a draft. It, Damn you, straight. You don't need How to go into blind. It it doesn't because we know. Listen, you you get the agent in January. All right, when the league is over, you yeah. work out for the combine. Okay, this agent is paying for this stuff. Okay, those are extra things. The draft is in April. You don't get drafted. The agent and all your extra stuff goes away, and you become just another college student. Yep. So all that extra workout that you might have gotten from the agent's connections don't really help you the following season. There you go. Because it's three to four months before you're playing a game again. Five, six months before you play a game again. Uh, Monster X Gaming 652 on Twitch said, Hey, what is this stream about? Uh We're a Check daily, it out, man. We're a daily sports talk show. Go ahead and hit that follow button. We jump in Monday through Friday, every afternoon, sometime after 4 p.m. Central. And we talk NFL, UFC, college football, basketball, baseball, whatever. Whatever is going on, the hottest topics of the day, that's what we jump in on. Right now, we're talking about Jim Harbaugh's open letter to college football and the NFL. Uh, McKinnon said, I meant more along the lines of getting free stuff. I don't even care if they get free Who stuff. Who cares? Who cares? Like, I, I think what all of them should be getting free, free stuff. What free stuff anyway. are we worried about them getting? Because right now in college, they get free shoes, they get free shirts, they get free pants, they get free. Uh, who cares? Free meals, who free cares? everything. I mean, it's you know, it is what it is. Uh, oh. Matt said, "I need to be telling all these people about the murder hornets." Uh, no, <laughs> we'll let everybody find out about murder hornets. You know, don't worry about no damn murder hornet. Murder there you hornet. go. Uh, let's see. Monster X Gaming 652 said the uh, the idiots at CBS said the Patriots could tank this year. Don't believe the bullshit. It ain't happening. It ain't in Bill Belichick's blood. It's not happening. Sport. The CBS isn't the only one, by the way. And I call it out every time I see it on Twitter, on Facebook. You're lazy. The sports writers are just they 100%. don't they haven't covered Bill Belichick or they're just they're just trying to write the easiest article they can write so their editor will get off their ass. Yeah, he he said Belichick would probably rather be dead than tank. Oh yeah. no, he yeah, you they would have to murder him. Yes, 100%. 100%. Now, it, whenever you see the Patriots tanking, that means that Belichick is no longer the coach. That's damn straight. And and even then, I don't think Robert Kraft wants to tank. I think he wants to yeah. win. Like yeah, these guys Jonathan love Kraft, winning. These guys have they they've seen this process play out. It's just this isn't the NFL, NBA, man. No, the, this, come no on. it's not. It's just not. One player won't change your franchise. They know that. 
let's uh, let's wrap up this uh, this Jim Harbaugh open letter. Um, we agree with everything that he said. I don't oh, think I there's get, anything agree with wrong it, with but it. I'm, a, I'm the I am the Jim Harbaugh apologist on the show, but I it has nothing to do with who wrote the damn letter. I agree with it. Yeah, uh, Jose Monclova, another first timer on YouTube, said uh, <laughs> said it doesn't matter. The Patriots suck. So <laughs> they're just coming at you, man. I, I, it must not. be like we must be getting people in because you got that Patriots shirt on. Like that's nobody's not. saying a word about my Pat McAfee shirt. Nobody. But that's fine. I understand. I don't care about Pat McAfee. It's all good. <laughs> Monster X Gaming said the Patriots wouldn't even take with Steve Belichick. And he said because Bill would kill him first. Yeah, I believe that. Uh, I believe yeah. that. Hundred percent. All right. So we both agree with Jim Harbaugh. We yeah. we and now that doesn't mean that we think it is likely that it's going to happen because I don't think the, the NFL is going to let them do that. The NFL part won't. The, there's zero reason the NCAA part shouldn't happen. I Other agree. than the fact that the NCAA is just a bunch of cowards that don't want to ever do anything for the students at all. I agree. I agree. 